Hello everybody and welcome back to our Yes to All Nomads playthrough here on Banished using the Red Ketchup mod. We are in an okay shape. Uh, we're low on firewood and tools are not amazing, but we have a lot of people making tools here. Uh, although that could be part of the problem <laughs> that we're currently making copper tools in those places but we have uh, some coal production here that is to help us with carbon tools so logs irons uh, carbon tools last longer so even if we make fewer they're they're better in the long run Last time we played, we built this little little uh, mining town. Uh, it seems to be doing okay, I guess. We need to put a clergyman in there. We've got some families here, and uh, they have access to this little market. That keeps them fed and stocked up with the supplies that they need. We can go ahead and put two more people in here and in here. So we will be out of iron soon, I'm sure. I don't think there's any more. Oh, there is. Okay, we'll do that. Grab some of the ore that's down here. Oh, here's a bit of copper. Go ahead and pull that out. Now, I had also uh, extended this down. I at least made the decision to expand. And I haven't put the fields in yet, but that will be I don't I usually do 8 by 11? What? That's an odd decision on my part to uh, make those fields. I don't know why I did that, but I'll match those here. And then these ones, I think I might do the 8 by 11 this way. like that just for something different so once these are all ready to go I'll put in new crops for them so the tools as you can see here are right on you know they, they were at 74 just a little bit ago and now they're up to 81 so they're struggling and as you can see we're about to run out of iron so these guys are grabbing us iron ore let's max this out six these guys are grabbing us iron ore. They're already maxed. Food is holding steady at 25. They brought us more tools. Okay, that's good. Let's get another 50. And do these 500 hops. And okay, so Carrie mentioned in a comment about maybe the mill we can turn the hops into something. No, mm -mm. nothing here. So, if anybody knows, I mean, I literally wrote, uh, filmed a whole tutorial on using this mod pack and I do not <laughs> I do not remember what you do with hops um, I know they can be added to malt beer uh, in here not in there in here so this is what I remember you can make malt 
in a malting house on one of the other mod packs but I don't think there's a malting house if I can find the malting house none of this I would assume I don't think you can do that at the old barn pub I think that's just meals at the old barn pub barn pub meals yeah no no malt there so that means it's got to be a separate building so we have creamery butcher bakery greenhouse those are trees water well water tower pond apiary smokery saltery dry shack I don't see anything here about malt house. Oh my gosh. How dumb am I? Well, I know what we're building down here. So, once that gets built, if it ever gets built because of our glass problem, but once that gets built, we can make malt and beer and then we can make strong beer with all of our hops. All right, we're in the late spring. Let's go with, what was, let's go with like, maybe peanuts here, corn here, sorghum here. And then maybe cucumbers. And lettuce. Boy, we have a lot of fields on this save. I haven't had this much agriculture on a save in a long time, but look at the food. Not good, guys. Not good. We're going to be hitting another starvation. Alrighty. We have almost 70 extra people. Still not enough food to keep up. And I haven't even been expanding at like some crazy rate just the way it is I add food every uh, you know food generating things oh, no iron left just terrible I don't know if I need to build more iron mines none of this is scaling properly is the issue I don't want don't want chickens pigs goats how are we doing on uh, these meals 300 is okay but two laborers to only get that not amazing we have almost a thousand salt How's the new fishing spot doing? Under 300 fish. What the heck? Up here is like really good. 670. Although that one might, I don't know if it was finished in time. So our food after the harvest is up closer to 19,000. I don't know how to fix the glass issue. Shouldn't have traded away all that glass. That's the bottom line. They're just not getting coal here. We have, I think, lots of sand. It's so much salt. 
Yeah, we have almost 800 sand. So the issue is the coal not getting here. And that, you know, this game has built into it the ability to tweak, you know, prioritize things. But you can't, you can't say, don't put coal here, move it here. It just doesn't work like that. Clothing is in a lot better spot now that we have these. In fact, I should probably go ahead and bump that up. I can bump tools, but it's not going to matter. We'll never get to to that limit. We're going to start the die off yet? It's coming. It's coming, you guys. It's on its way. Another die off. Here, I'll show you why I'm saying that. I'm not just being a pessimist. Although, I do a little of that. But, look at this. Everything's hunky-dory. A little bump. This is probably nomads. Nomads. And then, this is all the, the steady expansion that I was doing. Oh, things are fine. Let's expand. Let's expand. Let's expand. And the population is just taking off. We're what, 500? Yeah, 536. Great health, great happiness. Educated is down. That's sad. Might need a little bit more, a few more schools here. But we did get this built, yes, right here. Forgot to hire a teacher. Uh, but hopefully they will help out some of the youngsters on this side of things. So I feel like I kind of want to finish these buildings, but I also know that it's going to influence our population. Oh, more and more nomads are showing up. Guys, guys, why did I pick this as the theme? Oh, no. Well, just to review, this is a yes to all nomads save. 70 more people when our food is falling. This is going to be bad. This is going to be very bad. All right. It's cool that you're bringing me tools. We could use tools, but we also need food. So I'm going to turn off. What? I was going to turn this off and, oh, carbon tools, yeah. Okay. Trade. Can we afford a hundred of these? Surely we can. Let's do that. There it is. Thank you. Look, look at all this yellow. Oh my word. It's it's late summer, so we're bringing in the harvest, and then we're going to start dying. We have more people to go gather food, at least. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, man. I hope you guys are laughing at this as much as I am. The timing on that. We went the whole last episode in the first half, almost the whole first half of this one, with no nomads. And then, boom, 70 show up. Yeah, the reserve of tools is low. You think? We just bought 100, and they're going to be gone instantly because we got an influx of 70 people. Yeah, we are not going to survive this winter. Like... We might survive. The city will still exist, but we're going to lose a lot of people. We need that food, extra food, to be in the like hundreds of thousands. Oh, they got all that. Ooh, okay. 
and dysentery. See, this is the, uh, the thing about accepting nomads. We've gone over that already, but okay. Uh, so if you are new to the series and you're thinking like, what are you going to do about the, the disease? Uh, we have a clinic right here in the middle of town. And my philosophy, we should probably build another one over here on the other half of the city. But my philosophy is to uh, just let them go to the doctor. And some of them die. But we can't. Like, there's no way to pick someone up and drop them at the doctor, right? You just have to hope that they go there like they're supposed to. Uh, I think I'm going to cut down some trees, and hopefully we can turn them into firewood. We have a pretty significant firewood crisis right now. We'll clear those trees. We'll clear these trees. Clear those ones, some of these. We'll do some of this through this area. And maybe a little bit down here. Okay. Laborers should have plenty to do. Hopefully we can get ahead on firewood front. I might need to do more lumber mills. Look at the tools. Tools are out again. This is crazy. I hope you guys are learning. Uh, if you decide to accept nomads be careful and don't accept them all <laughs> i know a lot of people have uh, offered suggestions on this series of things i should and shouldn't do um, number one is don't take on a silly challenge like this if you care about min maxing the game i wanted to see what would happen in some ways it has gone exactly how I wanted in other ways it has been a disaster and that's that's what testing is for that's what makes it fun it is a game I'm not doing this this is not the world championships of banished I'm not trying to win the game there's no win condition you just play just to remind everybody the the stakes involved there are none zero zilch nada I'm irritated that a lot of things are happening that I have zero control over. We have 145 laborers, and what, what do you guys want me to do with them? <laughs> Put two more there. Max these out, see if it helps with uh, food production. Starvation, first one. There we go, down to 600 food. The die off has begun. How many people do I have? How's this fishing dock even doing? 400, that's not terrible. Okay, that's already maxed. Get that maxed. That's maxed. Just no coal is getting over here. I don't I don't know if I should put a coal mine in closer. I mean they're digging coal right here. <laughs> I I just genuinely don't know what to do. Some of these maybe maybe if I can I do this? Can I say like priority on getting them coal? I don't know that that's how it works. What is it? This? I guess. 
So typically what I do here is remove that and then gather these. And once it's all clear, once they do that job, clear this food, then I'll put the, the field back. What is that? Peas? I think that's peas. Food is low. We should be able to get a little bit ahead of it right here. more area for food gathering until that gets stabilized which might not ever happen but a girl can dream as they say what a crisis what an absolute shambles Let's take a look at the population graph now. <laughs> Looks pretty ugly, isn't it? We have too many farmers. Okay. We have one hunter. <laughs> I don't know how much that would help. nice of it to take a little break from people dying, but I don't think it's going to last very long. That's not food? I thought those were food. Is it food? Did they deliver us food? Okay. Here's what we're going to do. Hopefully I won't accidentally mute myself here. Like that. All right, 4,451. Helpful. <laughs> How's that for a screenshot? This is fine. Everything's fine. I feel like I need to do that. That this is fine meme. All right, I think we'll hang on until year ninety-five, and then we can do the last five years as a last episode. Because this one started at year 90. So five years an episode is not too not too bad. Tools, clothes, food. We have 
We're doing nothing well. We have 137 extra people, and I have no idea what they're doing. Where, what is our, why are you making lumber? Let's put you on firewood. How much lumber do we even have? We have like a lot. I mean, heck, we still have, oh, I guess everybody has a home now with all this dying off. Maybe we build another clinic? I don't know. It seems too little too late. I think we might be able to squeeze one in there. Put a clinic right here. Does it need glass? Yeah, it's never going to get built. <laughs> uh, we haven't been able to make glass in 20 years because they won't. They won't get. You know what? We could try just doing firewood. Maybe that would help. Not that we have a lot of firewood either. Yeah the die off here it goes see this is what happened last time too right that because they they staved it off for a little while because we had so many people that had food in their house so they even when it went down low it was fine now people don't have anything in their houses so we really need enough people staying as farmers to get these this food in i mean we just bought four thousand food and we're still this bad crazy the next thing it's going to be the farmers are going to start dying and we're going to be in real trouble I'm going to start taking people out of the mine so they can help hopefully with the food tools no clothes the clothing issue means that people burn more firewood no firewood means that people burn more of the coal it's just it's all related it's all messed up too many new people all at once and uh, the infrastructure cannot keep up look at all those babies being born too I mean Normally you would be happy to see babies being born in your settlement, but in this case, it's just more mouths to feed that we don't have any infrastructure to feed. So. There's some pretty good economics lessons to be learned from this game, I'll tell you that. Completely forgot I built a forester out here. A little bit of a break from the die off. Maybe we'll be okay. Maybe this is the dip. A lot of people visiting folks in the cemetery, that's for sure. All right, early spring of 95. I think we'll end it here. Thanks so much for watching. Bye for now.